As the Iowa Hawkeyes control the ball first, the top scoring team in the country, and they waste no time getting on the board. Kate Martin for three. Hannah Marisa all over her. Martin gets another rebound for Iowa. Sydney a falter left alone. Such a difference from yesterday. In their first game of the Big Ten tournament, they hit eight of their first ten from the floor. Finally, Leilani Kapanis is on the board. That's your leading scorer for the Lady Lions. Didn't join the team until mid-January, battling a health issue. Immediate answer by Iowa, and it's Sydney a falter again. Eyes up, straight ahead to Stelke. And beautiful defense by Kylie Lavelle, but then there's Kylie Fewer back to immediately take it back. Gabby Marshall! Even though statistically struggled to shoot the ball earlier this year, she finds that stroke is like riding a bike. Clark with the defense, and Iowa is pouring it on. Fewer back. Iowa's guards are much longer than people realize, and they're moving well without the ball. On the pass, you have Iowa jerseys moving towards the rim. So that right there is open right now as McKenna Marisa knocks it down. Clark from deep. Yet to hit. 0 for 6 from behind the three-point line. Owusu creates the offense and has a chance at a three-point play. Allie Campbell cannot hesitate. She's a 40% three-point shooter. She's got to shoot a wide open three. Marshall. <laughs> Kylie Fewer back. They've been able to get to the basket at ease. Even though they love to shoot threes, it starts by establishing that inside-outside game. Ronnie Kapanis with a three to start things off for Penn State. Caitlin Clark dishes to an open Gabby Marshall. You knew it was going in. Everyone in this building knew it was going in. Marisa out to Shea Chesky. She hits her first three of the day. This is a different Penn State team. Chesky to Marisa. She'll fire. Book it. Beautiful skip pass by Shea Chesky. Talk about all the great Melissa Dixons and the Sam Logics, Bethany Doolittles. This program's been elite for a long time. That guy's struggling to score right now. McCabe ends that with a deep shot. Stokey swinging around to Feuerbach. That's another open look for McCabe. Two in a row. <laughs> oh, man. That shot is so automatic. Awusu will take the three-pointer. Her first three of the game. A falter all alone at the top of the key. Glue of the team, the mother hen as they've called her. Caitlin Clark hits the three-pointer. And Clark makes history once again. Chesky tried to pass to Marisa, got batted around in the Hawkeyes have it. Look at Clark creating offense. That one happened on a football field this past October in the exhibition match, the crossover at Kinnick. A falter with a career high scoring performance. And it's just a fun shooting drill, right? But Clark trash talks a falter the entire time. Just, I got you, Sydney. I'm beating you. You can't beat me. As Gabby Marshall hits her fourth three pointer of the day. This was a Penn State team that, according to Autumn Johnson, came into the game the last team out looking into the NCAA tournament. The falter keeps it alive. Clark again. Before a Northwestern game her freshman year, and we talked to her on Zoom, Lisa Byington and I, and I was shocked and blown away by how poised and mature she was for a freshman. She could adequately explain how to pass the ball at a high level. You brought up a moment ago the Tay Valade injury for Penn State. The other thing for the selection committee to, to keep in mind, of course, is another three goes. That's now 15 made threes for Iowa. Iowa Hawkeyes have their 22nd 90-point game of the season. They hold Penn State 22 points below their average and get the win 95-62. to 62.